Okay, so we just uh, potentially killed them all. I'm not too sure if it's dead or if we just spooked it for now. So now we are in a new area after escaping the ruined place. So let's go. I hope that's just the wind up there. It's really weird that it seems to be just affecting one big massive tree instead of all the other ones. The game is still pretty dark. In terms of brightness, not like, well, yeah, it's pretty dark. We've come across some dark stuff so far. Please don't follow me, Mr. Huge Tree. What is that? Sounds like Sounds like what? I don't even know what that sounds like. Okay. Uh Oh. Sadness on a swing. Hey, kiddo. Sadness. Oh, sadness. Is that you? Oh. Hi, Maria. Did you find what you were looking for? I was hoping you could tell me. Hmm. Sadness. I need you to focus. Think back to as far as you can remember. What do you see? Is this a game? Yes. I'm afraid not, hon. This is important. Listen. I know what Richard did. <laughs> Was he the one keeping you here? Marianne! It's okay. I've sent him away. He's gone forever. Lily. Lily? Lily. That used to be your name. Do you remember? All that's happened. Your father. You remember him? I remember. Oh, mommy. Oh, she was so pretty. But, but so sad. Just like you. It must be nice to remember your mommy. Mm. I never met my parents. They. They. We were in an accident when I was very little. I was the only one who made it. It was really lonely without them. I, um, I know what that's like. Ever since my friends... This is a lonely place, Marianne. I shouldn't be here. Sadness. You'd be better off somewhere else. Maybe I could send me away. No, Marianne. I can't leave. Not yet. But why? Aren't you afraid of the monster?
when it breaks you, when it puts you on, it, it'll finally be able to leave this place. But it, it will never be full. It will never stop killing. Then let me send you away. So we can both leave. Now that you remember who you are, I can help. No, Marianne. It's not just about me. It's you. You have to remember the dream, the fire, the red house. Is the Red House? Are you there, Marianne? With me. You were always with me. I'm so sorry. Lily? Because we're sisters, right? I think that's Mom, what is. Just when I thought I could finally send her away. Thomas? I really hope you're still out here. Because I'm running out of options. Oh, got stuck. Really, nothing here. Hmm. Can't go up there either. Okay. The music just got super quiet there. Where did my dog go? My little dog friend, where did he go? He tried to get to Richard, too. Didn't realize he was no longer there. I don't think that was Thomas. Working man who could probably use a well deserved smoke. It's Francis, right? Uh, excuse me, but uh, who are you exactly? No, oh, just a guy looking to do the right thing. I imagine some would call me a patriot. Are you a patriot, Francis? Patriot, huh? I imagine others would call you something else entirely. Hmm. So it's the same man talking to Francis. Find the Red House. Investigate the tool shed. The spark's too weak to absorb. It's like it's missing something. 
I think it's missing a doll. Maybe. Okay, there's something inside. We can't go that way. Oh, is that something outside right there? No, I think that's on the inside. Are you looking for this little girl? Um, I'm sorry, but um, father doesn't like it when I talk to strangers. Smart man. He's the manager around here, right? Would you happen to know where he is? I'd love to have a word with him. Go away! Or I'll scream! Clever girl. Hmm. So Lily met whoever this is. But we don't know who it is. Anything else in here? Doesn't look like it. Thomas. You were here. This was your place. You're one to talk. This was your bright idea. No, they're already on to us. That son of a bitch is one of them. I can feel it. Fine, we'll make sure. Come on. It's almost on. One of them? Who are you running from, Thomas? Hmm. That's confusing. Anything else here? Well, you're one to talk. Oh, no. Oh, fine. I keep forgetting if you press that again, it does that. Okay, so we had something over here. Oh, wait. Oh, hey. A eunuch. Someone's got good taste. Nice. Hmm. July 27, 1983. The Gemini case. The investigation is moving along. I think Rekovich is starting to suspect something. Need to move fast. Tonight's the night. So they knew about Thomas. But how much exactly? And who the hell were they? Who is Henry? I think you belong outside. With the other creepy dolls. This looks like it could lift a pound or two. It's missing a handle though. We don't got one of them, sorry. We do anything with this? There's something under that engine. If only I could lift it somehow. 
So we need to get some power. Is there any way to get up the top area? I think that's where we have to go. Alright, let's do this first. Have a doll. Ugh, creepy. Now nah, we already looked at that. Oh, wait, I see something. Am I stuck? I am stuck. I am no longer stuck. <laughs> That wasn't too good. Did we do the thingy again? Ah, there we go. Right, so that should give us power to the generator now. So it's not working now? Oh. Um. The power's out. All right, so we're going to have to time this right. Can we leave her here? Can we go this way? Oh, we can. Let's see if this will work. Oh, God. I think it's not going to follow me while I'm standing here, is it? Because that would be awkward. Oh no, it must like stop no matter, like where it is. Is there any way for us to get up there? I don't think there is. Hmm. No, I think we're done here. Okay. Let's move on out. Was this... the red house? It was then I knew. This was the place. The answers were right in front of me. Buried among the ashes. There's gotta be something left. It looks creepy. I don't want to go there. Investigate the burned down house.
Hmm. All right, let's go check it out then. Oh wait, what's this? When you hear them squeal and you smell their bodies burning, you'll tell me everything. You'll beg me to listen. God. There were children inside? Was she? Was I? I think this is the fire that Sadness was talking about. Think you're so special? You burn just like the rest of us. Oh, Jesus. Who the fuck is that guy? So this guy is the guy called Henry, right? That we found the stuff or very confusing. They keep adding people in that I have no idea who it is. Team in Palooza. Uh oh. Okay, let's see who you really are. You fuck. Locked up tight, huh? You wanna give it a go? Be my guest. Nah, this one's all yours. I like to think I'm more of the brains of the operation. Dude, there's like a million like hey, bolt car things on the wall. <laughs> oh, <yeah>. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> yeah, a word too, I guess. Right. What do we have here? The Gemini case. Ooh. Oh god. Is this dude behind us? Shit. That's no way to talk about a government agent, comrade. It's the dude who kept calling everybody comrade on the phone. But who is he in terms of the story? <laughs> Socialism ain't gonna build itself. Fuck. You don't know who you're messing with, kid. Oh, but I do. I've spent a lot of time getting to know you, Thomas. In fact, you're kind of a pet project of mine. Oh, yeah? What's my speed of <laughs> <laughs> Funny guy. Ain't he oh. just... You like it too, comrade? Fuck you. <laughs> Let's play a game. It's called What Makes Thomas Tick? So, the Nazis found you in Warsaw when you were, what, three years old? Well, they were gonna kill you, but they didn't. No, they saw your potential. Set. But then boom. the war's over. In comes the heroic Red Army, and they locked me up for years. Fucking savages. <laughs> they do important scientific research. Find 
find out what it is that makes you special. And what is that exactly? Ask your mom. Oh. <laughs> Ouch. You enjoy it, don't you? Oh, hurting people like those scientists. What were you? 18. I saw the photographs. I know how to make a man hurt, but I gotta say, I was impressed. Stick around. We'll give you a live demonstration. And there you were, free at last, but always on the run. And look at you, you almost made it. But you had to use this power of yours again. And on who? On your best friend, Richard. You had it coming. Yes. yes. I know, you want it. Revenge, I understand. I would do anything for my child, too. Whatever it takes. Leave my children out of this. Children. Yes. How much pain would you endure to keep them safe? What would you sacrifice for them? Your freedom, maybe? Let me go, you piece of shit! That's what I thought. I'll let you go. But first, I want you to tell me all about these powers of yours. Then earn it! Come on! Enough of this sissy shit! Hit me! I thought you'd never ask. <laughs> Get some rest, Thomas. The next time you wake up, the real pain begins. What's that mean? That don't sound good. Oh no. Wake up, sleepyhead. Time's running out. Where did you do? Here. Oh, dude, that is harsh. They're still in there, Thomas. You show me now. I will, comrade. Whatever it takes. Dude asked for it. It's his own fault. Let's get him, Thomas. <laughs>